look so much. I'm so glad that I'm back, recorded, and giving you girls what you need. Okay, we all need makeup life, okay? And I have been really, really, really sad that I couldn't record. So, I have to get back on and I have to record for you girls and give you what you are asking for. And I've been gone too long, but I'm sorry. You know, I have to get my stuff together. I did graduate school, by the way. Ah! So, I graduated on January 8th. And I was super duper excited. And if you follow my social network or my app which is in the itunes store please go cop it okay um you can find it at miss Brittany j download it i'm super, super excited about it and i do post and i just started a snapchat and my snapchat is king Brittany j it's all together and at the end of this video i will show you girls on my phone so that you can get it properly and i will list it down below okay so without further ado bugs let's jump right into our january favorites item nothing crazy because I don't want the video to be extra long I just want to come and tell you girls that you know your girl is back and I'm coming to give you some favorites okay all right all right so the first item I have is a foundation okay and the foundation I'm just gonna randomly grab as I go what's in front of me okay so um I'm just gonna grab them and go and give you what you ask for okay so the first thing I have in front of me is a foundation. Now this foundation is um, the Dream Velvet by Maybelline. Oh my God, girls. Once this came out and I'm like, what's the rave about this? So I went out and I purchased the Milani. I purchased this guy. I purchased the L'Oreal, the cushion one. I purchased all three of them. And then I was like looking for more. I'm like, okay, what else is new? So um, I purchased them and I did, what I did is do different stuff days where I try each foundation to see which one I like the most okay so this guy won me over and I did give me a backup because this is a full coverage foundation and I really love this so much so I hope you guys can see it but this guy right here is the bomb okay oh my god I love it I have the call the <clears throat> excuse me I have the number I have mine in the number 92 which is caramel and this is a soft matte hydrated foundation which is the bomb and I did not get the little sponge that came with it I just used my beauty blenders because I have a whole container full of them so I just used my beauty blenders or whatever and um, I already have a tool like that so I figure why waste the money whatever you know it's just it's just too much for me too much going on but um i like to use a damn beauty blender with applying this and i do have it on today and it does last me all day and i actually when i wore it to test it out um i did wear it all day and i did run around and everything i was sweating and i did i got a little oily but nothing like where i'd be like oh my god you know so this baby right here is the bomb and this is why it's one of my favorites okay all right Next we have is another Maybelline product. This is the Master, the new Master Fix um, Setting Perfecting Loose Powder. Now this powder claims to set and modify, blur, and smooth your face. Okay, this powder is really, really the bomb. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to you. This is really good. Um, the only thing I did do, like when I first got it, I used to set my under eye concealer. It is not for that. It gives you like a white effect once the flash hit it. So it's not for that at all. Um, what you want to do is um, use this to set your fa your face after you completed your whole makeup application. And it'll just give you a flawless blur finish. Like, be now, slay, nasty. Okay, it'd be nasty like that. Alright, so <laughs> that's my that's my favorite. The next thing I stumbled upon at Walgreens is the Real Technique um, Deep Cleansing Gel. This baby, it smells so good. This is about $9. It's messy because I've been trying to keep my brushes clean because there's so many of them. Like, it's so many girls. It's ridiculous. And I keep buying brushes because they're a strange addiction. And I don't know why. But they are. Okay? So, this smells so good and cleansing. And I really love the way this smells. And it cleans my brushes and the makeup out of my brushes just like that. The only thing, the only bad thing I have to say about this is you do have to give it a nice big dab, like a nice droplet. Um, if you give like a little droplet, it won't fully clean it. You need like a nice size, dime size to clean the brush brushes, the big brushes. Now, if you do the small brushes, you can get away with a little bit. But the big brush, you have to use a little bit more. But these, this get it really, really clean, okay? Really clean. And they did the bomb by, um, 
creating this. I love it, okay? So I did find this at Walgreens for $9, just so you girls know, okay? All right, next we have is Black Radiance True Complexion Shine Control Primer. Now, I used to use this in my new, in my older videos when I first started doing YouTube, and this is the bomb. So I'm reunited with this, and it feels so good. Okay, and I really love this. This one's you about six to five dollars in your um local drugstore, and yeah, it just it works really well. It is white, but I don't like the. I use this. See, I haven't opened it anything. I just use my old one, but it is white, so yeah. But it does work because I'm a very very oily girl, and I love this. I swear by it. Okay, all right. Okay, next we have is the Fergie Wet and Wild. Um, this is dirty. This is Hollywood Boulevard, and this is a highlighter. And look how dirty it is. I've been using the heck out of this, and it is just the bomb. Hope you guys can see it. I love it. It gives such a great payoff. Oh my god, look at that. And then if you damp your um, I like to use my fan brush. I'll show you right here. I like to use my fan brush and damp it spray with a little setting powder. And brush it in here and then put it on my face and oh my god you will be highlighted to the <laughs> okay all right all right moving along the next product we have is Sasha buttercup setting powder this is the bomb I purchased because Nature B raved about it so I'm like let me give it a try I did purchase this for my birthday but um, I didn't even do any videos on you know things I got or anything like that because I think it's kind of getting overrated and people kind of get offended by it so I personally don't get offended by it because I love to see what people got, but a lot of people do. So I'm just like, girl, no, stop it. Don't do it. Okay. Next. Try next year. We'll try next year. Okay. So, yeah, I really love this. Give you a nice yellow payoff underneath your eye and it sets like a filler and you'll be highlighted and slayed to the gods. Okay. I'm going to say slayed a lot in this video. Okay. All right. So, yeah, Sa Sasha Buttercup Cosmetics. And I will list, um, we'll link these items down below. And. This ran me about $20, I believe. And then I did use Nature B code too. Um, I don't have a code, but she had a code. And it did, I only paid $17, I believe. So, yeah. All right, so I have two items from City Color Cosmetics. This is the Highlight Trio. And I did get the number two. This is, um, this is in number two. It don't really say the number. And, oh, this collection two and this collection one. And, both of these babies are very, very pigmented. I don't know if you guys are uh, familiar with City Color Timeless Palette, but these basically where the highlighters come from. If you have that palette, you basically have these. Um, but I love this one because it's more of a rose gold highlighter, and this is more of a champagne. You have like champagne on the end, and you have these are like gold, kind of a gold payoff. So I will swatch these for you, girl. So as you can see. And this is collection number one. And I'm just gonna swatch it on my hand. So you guys can see exactly how it looks. Okay. I really love these. Um, they are they are not expensive at all. So you won't be breaking a bank by getting these. So, so I just double dipped. And then this is the number two. It's rose gold and it is really, really pretty. I hope you guys can see this, but I'm going to show you this anyway. Okay. And this is the collection. Oh, this is collection number two. And I have collection number one right here. So you guys know. All right. So the next part we have are by um, <laughs> ColourPop. And these are ColourPop lap lip. The ColourPop uh, matte lippies. <laughs> I love these so much. Um... I have just put in another order, so when I ha when I get my order in from City Color, I will be doing a haul for you girls. But um, yes, I have a few over here that I keep on my vanity because I love these and I always reach for these every day because I love a good matte lip. And it, to me, these are really good. I tried some other matte lippies and some of them crumble and I just be like, $20 for what? I'd rather go to ColourPop and pay the six bucks. Boop. So I do have the one in Friday and this is a black. I did purchase this when it was Black Friday, and I hurry up and got it, and uh, my baby didn't understand, but I had to get it, okay? And then I do have guests. I do have many others, but um, these are the two I reach for the most because I do like a nice dark lip, okay? So this is a dark, this is a black, and then this is a dark purple, okay? And the only thing I hate about these is that 
you know, the writing comes off. Oh, I hate that. But anywho. Okay, next lippy we have is from the, oh my God. This is from the collection. This is from L'Oreal Paris, the collection exclusive. This is the Eva lipstick in Eva's Red 403. And I do have it on right now. And this is how it looks. It smells really good and sweet. And this is how it looks. And I will swatch it. It's a nice red. Really love it. It is a matte lippy. So if you guys are into matte lips, um, this would be perfect for you. But yeah, I really love this. And I can't I can't think of how much this costs. Um oh it was five bucks. It was five bucks at Walmart. That's where I got it from. Okay. Next item we have is Salon Perfect. Perfectly glamorous eyelashes in 614. And on here, it just caught my eye because it said blogger's favorite. I'm like, blogger's favorite? Let's see. So I do love these, but the only thing is they're kind of too thin for me. I like thick lashes, so I do double my lashes when I wear these. And um I had another set of these, but I kind of messed them up. So I just wanted to show you girls these. I did wear these all last month, and yeah, I doubled them, and they are so fabulous and they just flare out and it's like va va boom okay all right so next next item we have is black radiance true complexion contour palette and i have mine in medium to dark and they do have um a darker one too um i didn't get the dark one i just got the medium to dark because to me this is dark enough for me oh my god at first i did not know for sure about this little guy but oh my god i paid seven Wait, the first, this one I got, I got this from Walgreens and I paid $9 for it. Then I got another one from Walmart and I paid about 7 bucks. So, I'm telling you girls, go to Walmart to buy your drugstore makeup because it's way cheaper than CVS, Walgreens, any of them, okay? I'm telling you, trust me, I shop around and I, I, be make, I make sure that I get the right price, the best price for my buck, okay? Well, babe, buck okay 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 so this is how it looks it's really really nice and I love that it does have you know instructions on for people that are not familiar with contouring and stuff like that they do give you instructions and everything I really love this a lot and it does have a highlight in here okay so this highlight is kind of hard to deal with you have to scrape the top of the surface that's what I did um, to get the really really bronze glowy glowy highlight that you're going for i started with the bottom of my makeup brush and then i sprayed my brush also and then i just um switched the brush around and i just swiped it on and it was just the bomb but this is how it looks and this is the, the highlight very pigmented um and then we do have the sculpt and then we do have the contour so this is exactly how I like to use this I do go in my face with the sculpt first and I do then I follow up with the contour just to deepen the contour on my face and I am wearing it today I've been wearing it ever since I got it so um, yeah I've been wearing it all last month and I really really love it and this highlight is bomb too I don't have on the highlight today but yeah I usually wear this too but it saves you a lot um, a lot of time using this one palette the contour highlight oh my god it is the bomb okay and then the good thing is it do come with a two dollar instant coupon on the front so make sure you use that girl it'll be cheaper than that okay the next two items i have they are two face makeup palettes and i have the pretty rebel eyeshadow palette that i really really love that's how it looks and the colors are so bomb and pigments that you guys know two face have bomb diggity eyeshadows i love them but um, some of the palettes is just like, nah, I got it, whatever. It's, you know, and some you'd be like, I need that because those colors are bomb, okay? So I've really been loving this palette. This palette is super old, but I always like to reach into my old palettes and, you know, make that face pop, okay? And the next palette we have is Too Faced Chocolate Bar. This is the bomb. And I, mine still smell like chocolate. It just baffles me when people be like, my palette don't smell like chocolate anymore. I'm like, what are you doing? Where are you storing it? That's the question. Where are you storing it? Okay. 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 So, um, yeah, this is my chocolate bar palette, and I love this. And I did haul on this when I got it, but yes, 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 yeah, I love it. And the colors are the bomb, and mine still smell like chocolate. <laughs> all right. All right. Um, that's pretty much. Oh, wait, 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 wait. 
Okay, no, no, no. I do have Morphe palettes. Oh, I love these Morphe palettes. And I kind of splurged on these and kind of got all the colors I could think of. So I did get a lot of Morphe palettes. And this color is the, this palette is the, um, color smoky palette and I labeled the back of mine so that I can know what I'm using because once you take them out the box you don't really know you just got to go by the number the little sticker on the end and come on out like who's gonna remember that so I label mine that's the best, best way for me to keep up with them so this is the color smoky palette and this is how it looks and I have been using the crap out of this I love all my Morphe palettes and I kind of just went crazy on my birthday and got these so Ever since I, November, I've been using these, but you girls know I haven't been recording like that. So I decided to share with you girls in my January favorites and let you girls know that Morphe palettes are the best needs, okay? Don't let nobody tell you they ain't. They are. And they'll save you a lot of money if you are a beginner at makeup. Get you some Morphe palettes. They are pigmented. They have great payoff. Just make sure you tap your brush before you apply the eyeshadow because you don't want it to um, have any fallout on your cheek. They are a little fall. Some colors are a little fallout e whatever, but you know, it's all right. Okay. All right. All right. And I have one book. Well, one magazine that I really, really love, and I just discovered it um, last month. And it is this is New Beauty, the beauty. Um, it's a magazine. Oh my God! And look, Chloe's on the front, and she is so gorgeous. This is, I used to be obsessed with Kim, but this girl, she just like, she was a, she a diamond in a rug. Oh my God. And she is just so beautiful. So, um, yeah, I've been really loving this book and the bomb. And I look through it all the time and it's full with beauty. Nothing but beauty, 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 everything, beauty, fashion. Oh my God. It is so bomb y'all. Okay. So, um, it is $10, but it's worth it. Okay. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it and that'll do it for our January favorites. I hope you girls enjoyed this video. I will see all my fashion makeup in the next video.